Welcome to Zoho Sales IQ. This video will be on portal settings inside Zoho Sales IQ. Log into Zoho Sales IQ using your credentials and navigate to settings and then to portal settings. Here, you will be able to configure all of the settings that you want to for your portal. The first section is the operator chat window configuration. By enabling the first option, you can display the typing status of the operator to your visitor. To let your operators share files with their visitors, you must enable the send files to visitor option. In a similar way, you can also share URLs with your visitor. When you enable the email visitor information, your operators can send emails that contain visitor information. Zoho Sales IQ provides automatic chat translation powered by Google Translate. You have to enable Google Translation inside portal settings. Your operators can share screens with the customers and to do so you have to allow screen sharing inside portal settings. Sales IQ provides the audio call feature and to exercise this feature you have to enable audio calls in the portal settings first. By enabling visitor chat transcripts, you can send transcripts of conversations to customers in case of any discrepancies. The next section is Operator Availability Configuration. This section will give you options to define the availability and the chat limits of each operator that belongs to your organization. You can enable Treat Idle Operators as Offline to show the availability status of all the idle operators as offline. You can also set the operator idle time and during this inactive period, operators do not handle any chats. You can also set the concurrent number of chats any operator can handle at once. Moving on to email configurations. You can configure your from email address and there are options to display the operator email ID, company email ID or both. You can define a name and an email address to receive email copiers, daily statistics, weekly reports, notifications when operators block an IP address, visitor feedback, chat transcripts, and missed visitor notifications. The next section deals with data privacy configurations. When you enable GDPR, you can control how your data is manipulated and you can also protect it from data breaches. You can protect sensitive data during exports by operators by prompting for a password whenever an export is made or you can choose not to prompt for a password. You can choose to tell or notify your visitors that your site uses cookies. Notify your users about the terms and conditions document before they initiate a chat with you. You can mask visitor IPs to protect them from being tampered with by other operators. You can view all of the features that you have enabled by navigating to My Chats and then to More Actions right above the chat box. This section will display all of the portal settings that have been enabled so far. I hope you found this video informative and useful. Thank you.